hello all welcome back to our channel so students in this video it's a most important video so in this video i will uh, tell certain tips and tricks and how to get pass in this subject c and c plus plus as many of you students were having backlog in this subject not only regular students already pursuing students and uh, already graduation completed students is also having this subject backlog so here in this video i will uh, tell some of the important uh, questions uh, not important questions important questions i have already given uh, certain tips and tricks uh, where you can easily get passing marks in this subject okay so first thing ma as it is a c language is a programming paper without uh, attempting programming you can't pass this subject okay minimum you need to learn the basic structure programming of two to three uh, programs you need to buy hard it okay so without uh, that you can't even pass this subject ma so because i am giving clarity before only uh, some students are saying me that only theory i have written if you have written only theory in this subject means you will definitely get fail though it is a 18 marks uh, is a passing marks 50 marks will be the question paper scoring 80 marks 18 marks is easy but uh, this type of practical subjects for them it is will be hard only one okay so here whatever the tips i can say is first you uh, remember the programs okay any uh, two programs or three programs you buy hard it okay anyway i have given the damn sure questions prepare any three units hardly seven to eight questions is there okay that seven to eight questions you need to prepare it along with the answers answers writing is nothing ma only program you need to elaborate it okay so answers theory part is zero okay just out of hundred percent five percent will be the theory part remaining 95 percent belongs to the problem uh, programming only so that's why uh, you need to learn the program and uh, program learning is nothing but uh, you need to remember whatever you are having in that book or material so just what they will see is whether the student is written the programs or not if in case if he is returning if he wrote means how much they have wrote whether they have attempted all questions or not so two hours will be the time no so you need to attempt five long and five short whether you know or do know the question you give a attempt okay what will happen if you attempt one or two marks they will give no for attempting also they will allow you marks so that's why some of the students what they will tell means uh, i don't know that question so that's why i have didn't attempted that question so this type of things they will tell but you don't do that mistake compulsory you need to attempt a full question paper how much they how many they have asked five long they have asked you need to write it five long okay so compulsory you need to clear out this subject this is the hardest one of the toughest subject in whole graduation again i'm saying one of the toughest subject okay so in first year uh, second sem and first sem out of uh, first sem and second sem c language will be the most hardest subject rather than accounts okay so you just practice whatever the questions i have given along with the answers notes pdf also i have uploaded in the telegram group i only made the notes easily if you find out the answers in cr material or any other materials you will get difficulties in understanding okay so that's why uh, i have made uh, my notes i will upload that notes in telegram group telegram group link is given in the description box and you present it okay and one more thing ma after uh, going into the examination center you use only black pen okay use only black pen after taking the booklet you draw neatly lines already it will be get nice so one line you need to draw for the margin no so you draw the lines neatly you present your question numbers okay handwriting should be neat okay so this is a common thing but you need to follow it okay that's for that's why i'm saying it okay and uh, next uh, you need to start part b only part a is only two two marks question 
if you have written only five to six lines that would be enough compulsory they will give one mark for attempting part a questions you ignore part a first concentrate on part b because part b consists of 40 marks so five questions you need to attempt each question carries eight marks no so five eights are 40 so that's why you concentrate only on part b and part a just two to three four two lines four five lines if you have written also it will be fine got it so like that you need to attempt and attempt every question especially uh, sixth sem students those who are having backlog of uh, c and c plus plus you need to take uh, this uh, subject as very uh, uh, like uh, sincere because this is the second semester subject no if you have uh, failed in this subject means again one year you need to be waste in the subject means uh, next year only you need to write the backlog of this subject okay so just uh, uh, be conscious about this subject don't neglect whatever the important questions i have given hardly 10 questions i have given if you perfect with the 10 questions you can score a or a plus also if you want only passing marks prepare any three questions from uh, the questions whichever i have given got it so follow these tips and tricks in your examination and programs they will not see whether you have written correct or not what they will see is uh, whether the student has written the programs whether they have written all the questions or not this they will consider mostly they will try to pass this subject but attempting five long and attempting five short is in your hands totally it is in your hands if you neglect this subject then you will get failed if you take this subject as since here and attempt every question and follow the tips definitely will pass okay? so this is all about the video students uh, if you like this video then do like share comment and subscribe to our channel and share with all your friends and groups okay hope this video will be useful to you all and uh, all the very best and see you all next video bye bye students